Birkenhead Park was the start and finish point for the Wirral stage. The fifth day on the Over Energy Tour of Britain. 174.1 kilometers awaited as they headed out of the world's first ever public park, which opened in 1847. The city of Liverpool in the distance going into the stage. Matthew van der Poel now in the Over Energy green jersey. One second advantage over Matteo Trentin with Jasper de Voice of Lotto Sudal third at seven seconds. Many riders looking to try and get in to the break of the day. It was Emil Vignobo that dragged the quartet off the front. The breakaway would contain Matt Bostock of Canyon DHB, Rob Scott of Wiggins Lacole, Jacob Scott in the King of the Mountains jersey behind in the Peloton Trentine, now in the blue points jersey. The race was heading back in to Birkenhead. They were on to Hoy Lake home of Chris Boardman. Going through it was Matt Bostock, who was defending the Iceberg Leaders jersey for his teammate Rory Townsend. He took maximum points on to the penultimate King of the Mountains of the day at Flaybrick Hill. Jacob Scott was looking to try and build a commanding advantage in that competition, and he took maximum points. Through the line with 30.1 kilometers to go. The breakaway was down to two. Just Bostock and Vignobo left at the head of the race. Van der Poel's Corindon Circus team, though, were doing much of the work. With the gap now down to a slender few seconds, the rear well readiness rider decided it was time to go it alone. But his effort is more of a chase for the combativity award. The Peloton were hunting him down still with Vanderpool's teammates on the front. They had been getting assistance from Jumbo Visma and Lotto Sudau. They were on to the final climb of the day. Through the kilometre to go point, it was Grandal Jansen who was battling with the somewhere bleed out of a case bowl. As they swept round towards the finish, it was advantage again somewhere. Could Dylan Gronowagen's lead out man, Mike Turnison, deliver him for another stage of victory? Case bowl mistimed his jump. Grunewagen, all he had to do was come off the wheel of his teammate. Boll was forced to go the long way round. And for the third time in this year's Tour of Bitten, the stage belonged to Dylan Grunewagen. Matt Walls took second, but more importantly, Matteo Trentin in the Blue Points leader's jersey managed to get himself up into third place and take the four bonus seconds. Confirmation of your stage result. Dylan Gronewagen does the hat trick ahead of Matt Walls and Matteo Trentin. Boll, Chimelai, De Bust, Swift, Van Asbrook, Affini, and Mark Cavendish creeping into the top 10. Energy Green Race Leaders Back into the green jersey. Matteo Trentin of Mitchelton Scott. A great sprint finish at the end. He now leads Matthew Vanderpool by three seconds. Jasper de Boist at 10, Simon Clark at 17, Turnison at 18, but watch out for the likes of Niels Pollitt and Pavel Sivikov, 9th and 10th, just 22 seconds down. <laughs> 